Alright, goose morning everyone. Goose morning. I know this will be kind of weird. Uh, no camera. I, I've looked at my face today and I went, nope. Nope, no, no face today. <laughs> Not happy with it, but that, that's life. Some days you, you get up and you look at yourself in the face and you say no. <laughs> and we're just gonna hang out. You guys tell me what you guys have been up to today. Or the past few weeks as I've been gone. I swear, I thought once summer was over, no one would bug me every weekend. But guess what? Every weekend, someone has bugged me. I have cut down a tree in my yard. I have hung out with family. My grandma has come down. I have hung out with Panda, and I can't say no to hanging out with Panda. Well, you see each other like once a month now. <laughs> and then if Aaron gets a weekend off for like a Saturday, I can't stream. I have to, I have to hang out with him. I don't get to hang out with him every Saturday. It's, it's just been every weekend, something going on. Okay, this is kind of loud. Maybe it's just the effect volume. Why is it up to 80 and everything else is like 40? Okay, I think we're good. We're good to go and explore because I am behind on clearing this map and exploring. I'm mostly going to be exploring today and popping some Gordos, so I think a no-cam day works out perfectly. So we just hanging. We just chillin'. Panda epic? Ugh. I need to- we need to do some panda streams. I want to have panda come over, we're gonna play a bunch of escape room games. Yes, it needs to happen. I know we didn't do, like, anything for Halloween times, but... I, I, I kind of have a little plan for something. Uh, I have some equipment that will be showing up. Uh, maybe today, maybe tomorrow, maybe by Monday. I don't have a tracking for it because I didn't purchase it. Uh, it was kind of a... Well, we got it for free. It was a prize for a competition. And you know what? I'll take anything for free. <laughs> Can't say no to free. But it's perfect for streaming, and I'm excited. I'm hoping my computer doesn't blow up once I set it all up. So, may still need to buy some parts. Oh, parts are so cheap right now, it's exciting. Now's a good time to maybe build a PC. Or upgrade it. I wish Panda would build a PC. Panda needs to build a PC. Ben, I see you asking questions, and I, I cannot... Confirm or deny. But either way, I'm excited. It's definitely something I've never used before, so I might take some, you know, a couple days to learn it. Has Slime Rancher 2 gotten any updates recently? I don't think so. Because I didn't have to update it. Let's have a look. The most recent thing they posted was like September 22nd, and that was just now available in early access. Uh, so, no updates that I can see. Yeah, that was like the most recent thing that they had. And I haven't heard anything. I was kind of surprised there was like no Halloween events. But. We're early access, so maybe next year. So this gives us time to unlock what's currently in the game. Get out of here, babies. We need you. You guys are not smug. Oh, you guys are pretty hungry. Speaking of, heard the news of the dude who made Oculus? No, I have not. What's going on? Do I have at least one of each chicken? As far as I can see, I, I don't have all the chickens yet. Right, old chicken for you, old chicken for you. Boop, boop, boop. 
already forgotten what everybody eats. Who eats fruits? Is you guys first? Do you guys eat fruits? Nope. Everything. Okay, you get a fruit. Ah, these guys are so smug. Eat it! Eat it before someone else does. No! You eat. Thank you. And then you guys get some fruits. Not hungry. Well, I guess the rest will go to the guys on the end. And then we go and explore. You're playing Slime Rancher 2 as well? Yay! It's exciting. Ah, I see Henry number 2 is still alive. Uh, he made a VR headset where if you die in the game, you die in IRL. No! That's a terrible idea. Why are we doing Sword Art Online? No. I didn't think it would be that hard to do, but... Oh my goodness, no. Who would sign up for that? This did not need to be made. What a terrible idea. No one here would do that, right? Have I been down there? He's also gonna make one you can't take off. This is a horrible idea. This is, like, evil. Uh, my man watched so many Sword Out Online. <laughs> uh, he did. I don't like that he was inspired. It it's kind of like this huge waste of money to make something that is so awful that he will hopefully never use. Who would sign up for death? You know how many games, like, I've started playing and you immediately die? Can you, you can't just pick up a game and have a no death. Oh, oh, oh. Just don't eat, don't eat it. Ooh, I got a gold floor. I wonder what's down there. I'm gonna get rid of my gold floor first. I know we just got here, but I'm gonna run all the way back and store that. Because knowing me, we might die. Oh wait, we still have zero deaths! We still have zero deaths in this game! Oh, okay. I was just thinking of the VR heads that you were talking about, and people get playing Slime Rancher. Do you know how many people are gonna run off the edge and immediately die? It is too easy to die in a game. It's too easy. Well, I guess if you're doing a one life, maybe, maybe give people, like, you know... A hundred tries before they die? <laughs> Give him a chance to learn the mechanics of the game. So many people are not going to leave, like, the very beginning area. My niece and nephew in Splatoon. This is so dark. How do we get to such a dark place in such a beautiful game? Yeah, it just was not- okay, I can't- I can't be fighting Tarzan here. We're, we're going, we're exploring. I'm sorry! You guys got this, I believe in you! Okay, we got rid of the gold floor. I'm gonna see what's down in this hole. I'm either gonna die or I'm gonna find something cool. Oh, hello! Only meat! I definitely didn't bring any meat. Hey, a pop! Yeah. Pink glow shrooms. These pink and springy mushrooms get their unique properties from their slime filled ecosystems. Well, very nice. Oh, there's meat in here! Okay, leave the rooster, because they might make more chickadees. Your awful sounds above. Alright, here's a couple couple hens. Not enough. Anything else interesting in here? These are interesting. There's a little exit out that way, which I am tempted to go out that way, but I will probably die. This is not supposed to be a horror game. 
Can you not fall from the sky and scare me? Get out of here. You think I should play Splatoon? I just, I don't have anybody that I would actively play with. I have too many games. I have this game. We almost lost a honey slime off the edge. That would have been awful. I have too many games. I don't, I don't need a heartbeat. I'm playing Monster Hunter Rise with friends. I am playing Fortnite with friends. <laughs> I'm trying to finish my battle pass. I think I'm like 70. And then one of my friends finished the battle pass completely. They have like the gold skins. They're crazy. They did all the bonus stuff. Um, another game I'm playing with friends is Inside the Back Rooms. I don't know if you guys have seen Inside the Back Rooms, but it is a fun, cooperative horror game. <laughs> I there were, there were some issues. So, like, me and Aaron died, and our friend Kay made it all the way to the end while we watched. Kay got the check mark. And me and Aaron did not. I've had to then solo it to get my check mark, which I did. I did beat chapter one by myself. It was difficult, but I did it. Have I talked to you? It looks like you're sleepy. I feel like I have. And then we're still waiting on Aaron to get his check mark before we go into chapter two, but fun cooperative horror game if you guys are looking for something different. Uh, we did it blind, so we didn't look up any hints or how to do anything. I have to say, like, the... The dog... The dog person thing. I hate it. It's scary. It's creepy. It makes its noise. It comes from the vents and it tries to eat you. It is scary. It is horrifying. There's a lot of backroom games. Interesting lore, though. Ah, well, the one I specifically did that I would recommend. Because we tried out a couple of them and not all of them worked out. Okay, let's see. So this is the one we played. I put in 5.4 hours just in chapter one alone and it's still getting updates, which is cool. So this one, fun. The one that we tried originally, I don't know if I put it in this list because I didn't really like it. I don't see it. Oh. Backrooms escaped together. We only played 24 minutes. I did not like. Did not like this one. If you're gonna play a Backrooms game, I'm gonna recommend this one. Just make sure you have friends. You can solo it, but it's just more fun to be frightened together. So definitely playing that game on the side. And then... Kay came around and he gave me a Christmas gift early. He doesn't even have this game, but he got it for me. He didn't have to do that. Oh, he's so nice. Not Now I need him to get it so I have someone to play with because I have nobody to play with right now. He went and bought me this. I love COD games. I, I'm okay at them. I'm, I'm your average player. I'm not going to get like a bunch of kills in a row, but yeah, I've been playing this. I've only put in 3.9 hours. Basically, I've been playing the campaign because I've never played the campaign before in any COD game. I've been strictly multiplayer, so I'm doing this for now. I as far as the multi- uh, not the multiplayer, as far as the campaign goes, it's fun so far. A little glitchy here and there, but that's to be expected with games. Uh, I like that one of the characters you can play is named Soap. I really like Soap. <laughs> So yeah, just doing solo for now. I don't get COD. Well, it's not for everyone. Some people are very much like, I only like uh, Battlefield. Well, I've never played Battlefield, but I know a lot of people prefer it over COD games. I'm liking this one. I would say like the sound effects are very on point. Like they're just satisfying to hear compared to, like, most games. Where am I going? We are... 
here and there's definitely some sort of like a barrier from get us getting here to here and I bet you it has something to do with this dude because I know this dude is in front of some sort of glowy door I bet I have to get rid of this one and he requires nectar do I really have to go find nectar okay we'll get chickens we'll find nectar who's doing spish bash all I see are water plots you don't like many shooters that's perfectly fine I find shooters to be more fun with friends. <laughs> Which is why I'm doing the campaign until one of my friends picks it up. Panda might pick it up. Me and Panda have played COD games in the past. Uh, we used to... We were roommates at one point and I bought a... I bought a PS3, which we shared. And she bought the COD game. And so we would take turns playing together until she got her own PS3, and then we definitely played uh, Black Ops 2 together. And then we played Ghost, we played a lot of CODs. Ugh, Black Ops 2 days were my favorite. Those were the best days. Okay, where is the best place to find Nectar?